Hello, when you walk here in Kyoto environs forest and I'm staying not far away from a Kumano shrine some days June 20th, you always see these ferns winter, spring, autumn and today's summer. So what are they? So when you asking that question about fern, what is the first thing? Immediately look here on the back side of the leaf. But it's empty. So what's going on? So no sporangia present. Maybe they will appear. Not quite. So sporangia are already here. Multiple combined sporangia on these pinchalized leaves, which are sporangia fours, leaves bearing spores. So and then after that step, you can recognize the fern easily. This is black gnome. So black gnomes have always like just simply pinnate leaves and this separated sporangia fours. So when you see that combination of character, you can be almost sure this is a black gnome. Also, all black gnomes have vertical rhizome. So in that case, like in that species, that rhizome is very slowly growing. But some black gnome species, for example, some South American ones, might grow much taller and in that case rhizome will become a trunk and black gnome can easily well convert itself into kind of tree fern so it might be like typical fern but when rhizome is growing taller well we can call it a tree fern that's an interesting thing as well so black gnomes, black gnomes is a, one of well typical common companions of cryptomeria forest of japan so yes so this is a black gnome in the Cryptomeria Forest, not far away from Kyoto, Japan. Thank you.